Hi everyone, welcome to Santa's Workshop. Uh, today we're going to be talking about restoring a gun for this particular toy, which is one of my favorites. It's called the Shoot 'em Up Gunslinger. Now the gunslinger has an option, and what the option is, is that it has a little light source right there. And that light source is what makes it collapse when upon a light hitting it from a gun. Unfortunately, the gun wasn't with it and uh, when I bought this toy. So now what I have to do is actually find a gun that replicates it and try to make it look like uh, it came with the toy. So I found this toy, this toy gun. And what it is, it's a gun that actually has batteries in it. And when pushed, it will actually give a sound like it has a gun. What we have to do though is we have to take off this orange cap and try to put a light in the front of it, almost like a flashlight, so that when the trigger is pulled it would also generate a light to uh, shoot the um, outlaw down. So let's get started. So what we're going to do first is obviously we have to get that orange cap off and that's usually a safety put on by the manufacturer so that you don't recognize that it's a real gun. So we're going to go ahead and pry that off. What I did was I used an X-Acto knife to actually pry off around the edges here so that the uh, this orange cap and I wouldn't break the outer band of this gun because I still like to have this intact. Now what I'm going to go ahead and do is actually remove their screws located here, 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 and here, and here. This is the battery compartment. We can take this cap off to show you the battery. Now I already removed the screws, so let's go ahead and look inside the gun. By gently pulling it apart, we can see that it has the two A batteries, the little speaker, and the switching network to make this go by the trigger. So once the trigger is pulled, point in there. Now what I did was I actually ran two wires up to this point here which is going to be the end of the gun and now I'm going to actually solder two more wires to bring it up what we did was to get the flashlight we actually took an old LED flashlight that I had and I actually took it apart and I'm going to use the LED light that comes with it so right now I'm just going to add the so what I did was I took some wire same kind of gauge which is about 16 gauge wire I made a couple of pigtails at the end, soldered two longer wires, wires on it that would actually bring it out the front of the gun because I have to also solder my light. So right now I'm going to heat shrink some tubing over those leads so that we don't uh, short them out. With the heat shrink now over the leads I can take my heat gun and actually shrink these, this tubing over. And what this will prevent it from ever slipping off. And there you go. Now that's C shrink. Now I'm going to pull it over to the top and see how our wire fits. So the wire fits fine. Now it's long enough. But also what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to create a housing for this light. This is what it came out of. It came out of the front of an LED light. This is the reflector that the LED will actually go into. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to measure the point as for what I need for the length. and I'm actually going to cut it off with a Dremel tool. So now I have a reflector and something that actually house the LED light. So let me do that and I'll get back to you. So using my Dremel tool I actually cut the plastic right in half as you can see. I'm going to use this part and I'm actually going to glue that part inside the gun so when the top of the gun sits on top it would act like a reflector and shoot that light which is right here that LED light towards the gunslinger so let me adhere that and I'll get right back okay welcome back uh, what we did was we shortened the wire up on this lead and we went through the red lens that actually 
goes into this area here of the gun and actually holds it in place. This is the cap we cut in half the, that has the reflector material in it. And this is the little LED light that we're going to put into this lens. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to glue this into there and then glue this part onto the red lens. And I'll get right on that and show you. So what we did was we actually welded the wires onto the light, soldered. The LED is inside the housing. We cut the housing down and actually glued it right to that red optical. Now when it goes into place, it should fit like this. So now we have a flashlight end into the gun. And what we're going to do now is we're actually going to assemble the gun and show you how it works. So here we have Black Bart, shoot 'em ups, and the new gun that we just put together. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take the gun out of its holster. Here it is. And I'm going to aim it at Bart and pull the trigger. And there he goes. There you go. The light flashlight gun. Thanks.